I don't get it, man. Like I grew up in a small town and I refused or fucking refused to be one of those breeders who like at 19 had like two or three kids. Like, like, look, it, it, if you're going to do that and you're going to be plenty of people be happy. Look, Zach, I know, I know I'm thinking right now, look, I'm like, Zach's got like three or four fucking kids over there. Like, like that's, that's why, why he's hot load. Zach, he's like 22. Mm-hmm. He's got three kids. Or he's something. never missed. He's never missed. <laughs> he's, he fucking like he's fucking sniper scoped in on that cervix over there. Just shooting hot loads. But uh, so, so no offense to you, my friend, but, uh, but God damn, like, like that is not the life for me. That's I can explain it life. here. Give me the floor for a minute. I was talking about type one, two, and three fun on PKN. So most of you haven't heard this. Type one fun, it's the roller coaster. It's fun in the moment. It's a good time. You don't often look back on it. That was like a emotionally enriching experience. It's just fun. It's good for right now. I don't know if I'm breaking up. Uh, type three fun's just not fun. That sucks, right? Type three fun's never good. Type two fun, though. It kind of sucks in the moment, but when you look back, when you recount it, that time you had a flat tire in the rain and you changed it and whatever, you know, that time you got stuck here and you had to walk through the woods, it sucked then. But looking back, that's type two fun. That was like, dude, that was pretty fucking badass after it Mm -hmm. ended and everything worked out. I enjoyed that. Raising kids is a lot of type two fun. You know, in the moment, it's a diaper and it kind of blows. Or in the moment, your kids bite in other people and it's an awkward conversation with the teacher. But looking back at like this thing that you've done, you've raised a human and made them Mm -hmm. somewhat a member of society. And and, uh, like even the bite in other kids thing, which sucked at the moment, it's kind of fucking funny, right? You know, when you you recount it. It's funny when they're 25 or whatever. and you Yeah. When you bit old man Jenkins in the the asshole. Yeah, but you can say that about anything, right? I can say that about prison but if i go back i wouldn't go to fucking prison you know like, like, like prison might be type two fun that's, i don't know or is it three you tell us it, it, is prison it type just three never fun. good prison is type, type three. three fun i'm glad i went to prison good. because now it's stories I, I told a girl last night i'm like she's like oh i'm so sorry you had to go through all that i'm like playing it off or whatever i'm gonna make a joke of it i'm like hey i always want to learn how to make a shank you know, <laughs> it's good fucking stories. I tell stories for a fucking living, so it's good fucking stories. But I would rather have not gone to fucking prison, right? Yeah. Well, I'd rather yeah. have not prison might be type prison. three fun. Some things just suck, right? Some things, Some things are never going to be good. Prison might be there. I, look, look, if if I could go back to the beginning and not go to prison at all or not get arrested at all, like I would. But I'm the the prison thing is cool. It's it's been fun for stories. People like the prison stories. I like having the prison stories. I like, like, like sometimes I'll just be like pissing in the bathroom and I'll be like, I went to fucking prison. <laughs> like, like, I can't, like just thinking to myself, because it's so absurd that I went to yeah. fucking prison. It's so absurd. You gotta absurd, think about it. It's, it's right? an experience. It's, it's, it's almost like how, you know, how people, uh, they'll travel and they'll get bumper stickers or whatever from different places or whatever, yeah. you know what I mean? Or postcards, whatever, souvenirs. Uh, in a way, jail, prison, it's not, it sounds ridiculous, but it's not easy to get in to. I mean, you know what I mean? No, I'm with you. I, I, yeah. no I, I feel you right now. <laughs> it's it, it's it's like those people who have, who have like the the like the the distances they've ran on the back of their car. Yeah. Like like oh, yeah. I did a five k, and then I did mm-hmm. a, like a marathon, whatever a marathon is. We've talked about this before, but I never remember twenty eight twenty six point two. I think twenty six point two. They'll have twenty six point two back there or whatever. Yeah. They'll have yeah. like all the k's they've ran, all the mile like runs they've done. Wait, the, Tucker, like, did like, you know that from COD? No, runs, I think no, I think I re- I literally was thinking of that fucking sticker, right? That that okay. you're talking about. It's I don't know how long it. I'm now I'm looking it up. Is it 23.2? That That's my guess. I think it's 26. That is 26. 26.2. 26.2. But yeah. it's like okay. it's like there's only a certain you know, not everybody's been to fucking prison. I think it is kind of cool that I went to prison. I don't hide it. When I meet new people, I'm like, "Yeah, I went to fucking prison. Can you believe it?" And they're like, "Nah, <laughs> you didn't go to prison." I'm like, "I did." Right. You want to see my prison clothes? I kept them. <laughs> like, like, I got souvenirs. I got, I got, I got, I got a stand in the other room that says. Yeah, if that was true, he'd have showed us his prison it. clothes by now. I, I've got they're they're lame. It's 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 like gray sweatpants and Nike flip flops, right? Like, it's, it's, like, like you wouldn't know they're prison clothes, but they're my prison clothes. That's what I wore in prison. I wore Nike flip flops, gray uh gray sweatpants, and uh and fucking like gray t shirts. Like, I like, like, like Nike, the Friday. official sponsor oh, yeah. of yeah. Tennessee Penitentiary, wherever you were. <laughs> no, that, it, it, that was kind of a the the casual thing was kind of like a nice part of it because like the first week I had to wear like prison uniform and it's like really scratchy green denim mm. it's like 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 full green denim suit and it's like yeah. rubbing all over you it reminded me of my uh, my jail clothes because in jail you've got a jumpsuit 
an orange jumpsuit with like nothing, no underwear underneath it. And it's just like, they let me keep my underwear. Um, Cause I like sort of kind of social engineered my way into keeping my underwear uh, on the uh, initial, uh, uh, whatever they call it. Like, like when I was being processed Intake, or whatever. maybe something. Intake. Yeah. yeah. And I, I was like, it was so funny. I was wearing my most embarrassing pair of underwear. I have these uh, yellow under, I don't know where they are now, but I had this yellow pair of boxer briefs that had like a picture of an elephant's face on the crotch. <laughs> and then it had like an elephant snout that your dick went in. Like, <laughs> like, like, hmm. like, like, and they're really funny. Like, like, like if you're, oh. if you're like showing a girl, like for the first time or whatever, and you're like, 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 you know, like you're getting naked with a girl and you're like, what do you think of these? <laughs> And like, I don't know what I don't know what elephants sound like, but you know you make them make elephant noise, and then she's just like, "That's hilarious! That's fucking hilarious!" Like, like, but that ain't what you want to wear when you go to jail. <laughs> and so, like, I'm getting like not strip searched, but like I'm changing into like my jail clothes, and I tell the guy, I'm like, "Hey, man," um, he's like, "Yeah, underwear, uh, shorts, like shirt, everything goes in the basket, and you put on this stuff in the other basket." And he's not looking or anything, but he's like sending me into like a little private little nook to do this shit. I'm like, Hey man, um, can I keep my underwear? Um, <laughs> I'm wearing the most embarrassing pair of underwear I've got. I'm like, it's literally an elephant's face on my crotch and my dick goes in the trunk. <laughs> like I, I said that to him and he just goes, damn, that's great, man. Where'd you get them? <laughs> and I'm like, Amazon. I was like, I wouldn't have worn them today if I'd known this was going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, just keep them on, man. Just keep them on, man. I don't need to see that shit. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah, I, I, I'm not happy that I went to prison. But at the same time, like, it is interesting to have those that, that life experience. Mm-hmm. Um, and there are some life experiences, like, like, like what he says, that are like, yeah, I did that. Uh, I'm glad that I have that experience. But if we go back, I would change it. So it's it's a little bit of both. It's just, it's this weird like hybrid experience. It doesn't even have to be which I got fired once, right? This is my second job, real job or something. And it was super rough on me. But in the end, I was better for it. You know, that job wasn't right for me. And uh, you know, I understood consequences. It was better. I, I definitely have a better career in life because I got fired. So I would do it again, yeah. even though it really